yes, also I notice in the Western world, the first thing they ask, what job you do, where do you work? Whereas other continents, they ask, how are you and what makes you happy? Yeah, that's the thing that I've been talking about. Like, what, what do people focus on? What is more important to you? What is success to you, you know? For one person, success might be a fancy car, two, two apartments, uh, many wives, many mistresses, people adoring you, stuff like that. And then another person could be just like, I just need a few bucks to buy me some food and I want to live in nature and talk to my friends and that's it. And who's to say that one person's success is not enough to, compared to another person? Instantly competitive, yeah. Yeah, 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 it's the, yeah, it's the go and get, go, 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 get, 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 more, more accumulation and, and proving and competitiveness and, like, I know, I know, a, a, a small degree of competitiveness is good, you know, challenging each other to grow, but not to the point where you put your self-worth connected to, like, like you say, what job you do, where do you work, yeah. Like, that's, that's totally right, Kelvin. Like, I notice even when some people, when I ask them, how are you? They're just so baffled. Like, what? Like, who asks questions like that? You know? The how are you is saved for maybe the husband-wife situation, maybe once a week. Because even our relationships are not intimate most of the time. We, we are in relationships with people that don't even know who we are, and we don't know who they are. Because we're so stuck in who we think we need to be for other people and masks, you know? It's, dif it's difficult to be yourself in this world. We all, we're all trying to prove. <laughs> I'm that annoying friend who asks, how are you? And I give hugs. Stay that way. Stay that way. Don't let the world make you hard. Stay like a little child. You don't have to be the strong woman or the strong man, I am the brick with no feelings. Come on, we're all children. We have no fucking idea what's going on. And everyone is trying to pretend like, you know, like, what what makes a man a real man? What What is the definition of a real woman? Come on. Like, on a soul level, we're all children. Like, nobody has the ultimate knowledge, so... Yeah. I think more inner like more childish things more just like there's nothing to prove i have no idea what's going on i know about human design and i know about psychology and i can paint like really well and i can speak some bullshit on a live but ultimately i have no idea what what the fuck is going on <laughs> and i'm scared of things and i cry and I laugh, and some things, sometimes I'm insecure, other times I'm really confident and cocky, and it's all the big spectrum of human. It's not like, once you hit 35, you become this man that is so very functional and nothing else, like, come on. Like, yeah, you can be the adult, you can be the mature person, but it's also, like, you're still the child, you can still get scared, you can still get startled, you can still be worried, still be insecure about things. It doesn't end. It's not like, oh, now you, now I am mature. Yes, I am now fully fledged adult and ready to go. <laughs> That's why I don't watch TV or read news. It's there for distraction. I agree, Kelvin. It's not bullshit, it's amazing knowledge that is helping us all. Thank you so much. Fully fledged adult. Like, yeah, like I'm 30 now. My parents had me when they were 21. Like, I can't fucking imagine having a child yet. And they had me 10 years younger than I am right now. And I thought when people hit 25, they're adults. Then I hit 25 and I was like, mm -mm. Then I thought, okay, 30 is when you are adult. And now I'm 30 and it's like, like, I realize that everyone is actually pretending. Everyone is pretending to know what the fuck they're doing. Everyone is pretending. And the ones that are able to pretend the most and sound the most certain, those are the leaders. 
the ones that sound like they know what they're talking about, those are the ones that are in power. Fully fledged adult, yeah. <sighs> okay, I'm glad that I made you guys laugh and shared some knowledge. Thank you everyone that donated. If you like the content, if you like being here, listening to music, asking questions, make sure to follow. Follow here on Insight Timer. Follow on Instagram, I Create Lines, YouTube, I Create Lines. iCreateLines.com is the website. If you want a one on one session to talk about all these things um, that I speak about very generally, I can focus that on you and uh, focus on your issues mental health, emotional health, trauma, how to resolve blockages or human design if you don't know what human design is go to my website icreatelines.com under guidance there is going to be two sections on the website one section is artwork that's pretty self-explanatory and the other section is guidance where we deal with all these other things psychotherapy human design so you can check those out um every day from three to four cet is a one hour live like this one uh next one is tomorrow at the same time come back again tomorrow until then stay hydrated um keep it moving and stay a child nobody knows what the fuck is going on so peace peace out thank you guys